गुड इवनिंग एवरीबडी माई नेम इज मुकेश जगह एंड आई एम फ्रॉम वेन्यू डॉट इवेंट्स टूडे वी हैव अवर गेस्ट फ्रॉम अजाम टी वी लिमिटेड दार इस्लाम तंजानिया एंड शी इज़ द सी ई ओ एंड हर नेम इज सबरीना मोहम्मद अली वेलकम टू द शो थैंक यू सो मच सबरीना थैंक यू इट्स अ प्लेजर एंड ऑल्सो वॉट वी स्पोक अबाउट दैट यू आर रनिंग अबाउट मोर देन हंड्रेड एंड थर्टी फाइव चैनल्स बैक होम इन योर कंट्री एंड यू आर हेयर by some content yes indian yes so that it can be shown over there yes so can you let me know that what kind of content you generally take back home right. and what is the kind of audience which looks at it definitely they would be all with subtitles yes so yes. how is the market for the indian dramas or other content which yeah. is meaningful to at your home back home right um so basically uh tanzania first of all is a country with 60 million people right. and azam tv serves mainly the mass and uh, as strange as it sounds but uh, a lot of tanzanians are very fond of the indian bollywood and series as well so i'm basically here to buy content uh, as in series dramas but also bollywood movies Okay. So all the you know all the famous actors are very well known in Tanzania among our Tanzanians right. um and and they love these movies so we do buy a lot of uh, hindi content right. and most of it is then dubbed in our local languages uh in Swahili uh we also operate beyond Tanzania in U- Uganda in Malawi right. so we dub the indian uh content in Lugandan language which is also used in uh, Uganda and in Chichewa which is in Malawi so we basically uh, dub in almost three different languages what we buy from here so it's part of our huge content library what we buy from India and it gives us great pleasure to be here on this market right. today and uh, the movies as you said uh, is one you know, of the biggest things what you buy as a content Yeah. So are the older movies more preferred of the 60s and 70s mm-hmm. or is it the current movies which are more liked over there at present because in um, India 60s and 70s movies are very yes, popular. Yes. Yes. Uh actually I'm afraid it's more the recent ones the recent like ones. I think 90s going above. Right. Uh and it's mainly because the cast are so popular you know people right. know the Shahrukh Khan the uh Salman Khan uh, but they also love the Amitabh so i think that is the reason why it's more towards you know the the 90s going towards the present that is more popular okay yeah than the old one and how about the dramas yes so dramas uh, we are do are they the mythological ones which are uh, mostly like, they are like family uh, family drama romantic rom-coms some thrillers as well but uh, uh, most of it is family okay yeah most of it is family okay and yeah. the other countries which you are doing it like in malawi and uh, uganda also mm-hmm. so over there the pattern is also similar the indian movies yes of- Yes uh so we operate in eight countries so we are based uh, in Tanzania where our head office is and that's where our major market is but we also operate in seven other countries so in total eight uh All across, in Africa Yes East and Sub-Saharan Africa and the trend is the same people love mostly the movies the series family related drama and I think it's a good way that uh, to also showcase the Indian culture which connects with people beyond the Indian borders and also we must have appreciate that india has a lot of immigrants who have migrated into other countries and africa is one of them so we have a huge indian population which loves this content you know and during whenever a wedding is held in your back home country yeah are the indian songs played of or? course absolutely yes absolutely so we have a huge uh, a fan and love of bollywood by especially the indian community which is settled there and uh, all the you know all the songs the dances and uh, are are really adapted in these different functions okay. yes and also channel but are these movies also then screened on the theaters yes yes absolutely the new movies are screened on the theaters uh, we have several theaters across the country in different cities and whatever releases in india on a friday is also released in tanzania on the same day okay. actually so yes it's very popular it's very famous and people love it on a very lighter note in india if a song gets popular 
Yes. You will see a lot of people in the theater whistling. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Does it happen back home? No, it doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't. I've not experienced that. <laughs> but uh, you will you will hear them murmuring after it, but not whistling. I've not experienced that. Yeah. So India, it has been very popular. I know. And I know. Now the things have changed, but still, in, if you see in the older movies, yes, whistling used to be a very popular thing. Wow. So okay. Now, okay. And yeah. We we enjoyed it all over the years. Right. Time. Right. And, how do you see foresee that this market is definitely going to grow over there more you mean the indian content market yes yeah indian i think it's more also because the way the indian entertainment and content industry is also spreading its wings and how they're investing in their content making it more better making it more diverse making it more relative to people's real lives so when people watch it beyond the borders of india they can relate with it and as humans when you can relate with the content it becomes part and parcel of your life so you develop that natural liking and acceptability to it so i think that is one very huge plus point which india is doing in their entertainment and content related you know market which helps us who are beyond and uh, above the borders of india to really you know have this kind of content penetrate amongst our viewers who are not necessarily indians pictures speak more than the words uh, what are differences because of the content indian content be it on the film side or on the uh, drama side fiction side yeah what has grown also by people viewing those movies yeah is it the costumes or the clothes or i think it's more the story the i think it's more the story <laughs> no what i mean is that any other industry grown like uh, are the clothings of what are being worn by the uh, girls in the movie yeah has the clothing industry also improved and there <laughs> more demand for those uh, uh, different kind of things or any other thing it might be which um, might interest somebody else in the other industry yeah i i really am not able to comment on that honestly from where i'm sitting and the business that we are running uh, it's a bit you know not uh, so very you're more relative with the, yeah uh, movie content yeah yeah movie and series content okay. absolutely yeah thank you very much sabrina thank cheers you so much cheers for your interview thank absolutely. you absolutely thank you thank you